Other than my hairy legs, how do you like the shoe? Okay, I think Adidas has finally awakened itself in the year 2023. So let's unbox together one of the most anticipated retro performance shoe they just released and see how it stacks up. For the box, nothing special here. We have the regular dark gray box indicating a performance shoe inside and the text says Crazy Infinity 2.5. I don't know if there is ever a Crazy Infinity 1 or 2 existed. All of a sudden we jumped to 2.5, which is odd, but let's move on. Wow, the shoe is nice. Just a black and white simple setup, but it gives out a different vibe, which I totally love. This shoe instantly reminds you of the crazy one for Kobe. It's so iconic, but in the year 2023, we also have some fresh takes as well. The silhouette stays mostly the same, but the overall stance is lower and more aggressive. We still have the three stripes carved on side panels and this angled line from the toe to the back, but now it looks futuristic, like a space pod. Flip to the front, we can see the superstar inspired rubber shell toe in play with some tiny Adidas logos. The side panels are made with some sort of rigid foam for that side support. Around the back, we have the rubber cover heel just like the toe with a carved performance logo again. On the top half, we have a layer of zip closure mesh route covers the lacing system. Underneath it, we have a heavy padded tongue for the lasting comfort. Flip to the bottom, we have a semi-translucent rubber outsole with full-on herringbone for traction and a piece of black TPU shank in the middle for the rigidity. Alright, let's put them on feet for the heat check. Gosh, I absolutely love these. Although they feel chunky on feet, but this is a modern retro look we're going for. As for the cushion, not sure if there's any boost or light strike inside, but they're mad comfy like pillows hugging your feet. So, $460, is this a cop or a drop? Leave your comments below.